ladies and gentlemen. As promised, here's the whole video about the grill that I made over the period of last summer, which approximately took me about 4 months and my free time. Overall, it has been a great grill, I have used it a few times and I absolutely love it. And it definitely does its job. As you can see, I already put charcoal in there because we're going to be using it to have some delicious top sirloin cap. Uh, got the little motor here that powers the whole chain there, which is a regular cross rotisserie motor, I guess you could call it. And that powers the chain, which also make turn the four spears that I put under that go across. You can take two spears off and put the uh, flap or clap together uh, with two flats, uh, also rotisserie. Uh, which you can open, fill it up with all kinds of meat, patties, or chicken, which includes meat, and close it up, and then with a little butterfly knot, tighten it nicely, which prevents it from falling from side to side. And you can take that off and put a regular flat on there to grill basically steaks or anything like that. And then the other half you can use to saute. Uh, vegetables or shrimp or whatever you choose to do and it works great and that's a motor which can be taken off you just on loose that knot and take that pin out and then it slides right off and then you put it on the other end so that way you can do the original crossover rotisserie uh, for a turkey or a chicken whichever you choose to do which I am sure will work great but I have not done it yet but if I do I hope to make a video about it and the other end which I'll be showing you you can uh, lower the charcoal nicely to the bottom quite a way down which would uh, reduce the heat by a lot and you could uh, bake a big chunk of meat on there very slowly for hours and also you can bring it all the way up which makes it if your charcoals are dying you run out of heat and you can use a little last little bit of heat of your charcoal in the end I made it removable which you can use just for regular airflow or to add charcoal and it comes out on the bottom too so you can open that end completely there which makes it nice in a way especially in summer I think it will make it good and in winter I have opened it a little bit just to let a little bit air through because charcoal seems to be dying in winter faster if you don't have enough air the top cover is uh, actually half of a barrel. Oh, I got those. Uh, it can be easy taken off or uh, loosen those knots and you can just slide it off, and then you have an open grill there, which is very nice, and especially in summer. As I was saying, the top cover is a barrel piece which itself is very wobbly so it has an angle iron in the bottom there which holds it nice and stiff so it, it works great actually I did not think it would be working that great but it actually does so all in all it has been a great grail I have used it quite a bit quite a few times already and I, I hope to be using many more years so this is a short presentation it is Probably not very professional, but I hope you like it. And uh, please let me know in the comments below what you think of it. Thank you for watching.